Good morning, everybody. This is Max Farrell. This is Dex. And in this little short tutorial video, I want to kind of show you really quickly um, on these web based charts. Sometimes you might do something that kind of, you know, closes stuff out. So, like if you were to right click this side and hit, say, uncheck right access, and it's gone, you can't seem to get back to it. Right. Anything that you do here, you can't seem to get back to because it's just stupidly crazy. You just can't seem to find a way to click on that button to get that access or those prices back up. Or maybe you deleted this one. You can't remember which one it was and it's already saved. And every time you hit reload, reframe, something might come back a little bit. But hey, look, those prices are still missing. So let me show you something. This stuff is set on your computer's cookies. So it remembers, it tries to remember as much as it can about what's going on here, right? So if you've already saved a default or some, done something to save to default in one of the indicators, like if you were saving the information here and you came here and said uh, save as default, uh, you could try reset settings and hit OK. And that'll reset only for the indicator itself. But look, the price is still missing. So we got to find out how did we lose those prices? Well, there is a right axis and there's a little bug in trading view system. I can't seem to find on the embed code here on how to get that back up again. So you have to remove your cookies or clear your browsing history, but we don't want to clear everything. So if you're using Chrome right up to the top right hand corner, you want to click on customize that little uh, button there. And then you're going to come down to settings. You're going to shift all the way over and you're going to look into clearing browsing history. Now, some of you might have this checked already, okay? But uncheck that and make sure you only have cookies and cache images and files. Um, click. Everything else you can leave because you can save your password, you want to feel. It doesn't have anything to do with that. And then just hit clear browser history, okay? Let's go back to the website. And we can see that it's still there, right? So we just have to hit refresh on our screen now. And give it a second. I hit refresh a lot of times. <laughs> oh, and there we go. It's all back. All right. So that's basically how you fix the, uh, the prices not being on there. Now, just to let you know, when you do right click when the prices are there, it gives you a lot of opportunity to look at different things. And there's nothing in here really you need to do. It's just the prices are there. You can shift this to the left side, you shift it to the right side, you do things like that. But if you make it completely go away, boy, what a pain in the butt. All right, all right. I hope you got some information from this. I'm Max Farrell and this is Dex and uh, see you inside. And as always, trade well.